My name is Anna and today I'm going to be looking at some of the different ways we use the present continuous and the present simple. You'll find some of our other videos about this subject online so look out for those too. We use the present continuous also called the progressive for actions and happenings that have started but not finished. For example they are eating, it is raining, and so on. However, some verbs such as know and like are not normally used in this way. We don't say, I am knowing, or they are liking. We say, I know, and they like. Let's look at some verbs that are not normally used in the present continuous. Like, want, need, prefer, know, realise, suppose, mean, understand, believe, remember, belong, fit, contain, consist and seem. We say, I'm hungry, I want something to eat. We don't say, I am wanting something to eat. Or we say, Anna doesn't seem very happy at the moment. We don't say, Anna isn't seeming very happy at the moment. The verb think can be used with the present continuous or the present simple, but it's the meaning of think that makes the difference. For example, when think means believe or have an opinion, we do not use the continuous. We say, I think Mary is Canadian, but I'm not sure. Or we say, what do you think of my plan? Which means, what is your opinion? But when think means consider, the continuous is possible. For example, Anna is thinking of giving up her job, which means she's considering it. For the verbs see, hear, smell and taste. We normally use the present simple and not the present continuous. For example, we say, this room smells, let's open a window. We don't say, this room is smelling. We also often use can with see, hear, smell and taste. For example, I can hear a strange noise. Can you hear it? For the verbs look and feel, you can use the present simple or the present continuous to say how someone looks or feels now. For example, we say, you look well today. But we also say, you are looking well today. We say, how do you feel now? But we also say, how are you feeling now? But if you're talking about things that happen repeatedly, use the present simple. For example, I usually feel tired in the morning. We don't say, I'm usually feeling tired in the morning. That's all for today. Now it's over to you.